Hey, it's Josh here from Create Studio, and I'm really excited to show you what's new inside our latest release. So first of all, on the timeline, we've created a way that you can now add transitions on one simple track. So when you've basically got media one after another, you'll simply see a little icon here. And if you click on that, you can go ahead and select a transition. And what you also notice is we've created a whole bunch of new transitions as well. So just simply select one, you can go ahead and adjust the duration. And if we preview this, you can see how cool that looks. This also works with any element, whether it be an image, a video, or a scene. You can simply hover your mouse on there uh, and choose a transition like so. So you're really going to love this. You can also overlap your media and also add a transition that way as well. Um, but this just keeps things really nice and simple on the timeline. Now, the other thing we've also done is we've revamped the media panel. So you'll be able to see, instead of having the stock panel up here, we've basically put all the integrations down here so you can add your media directly inside the media panel. Um, and you'll be able to notice when we've got Pixabay, Pixels, Giphy, you know, you've got Cover as well as SVG. And we've also integrated with the VecTZ uh, platform. And this is, we basically have to bundle it with the OXS Pass because it's like a paid um, integration. Um, but yeah, well, if you're an OXS member, you can go ahead and search for, for example, burgers like this. You've got your videos, images, as well as transparent PNGs, which is um, a massive time saver. You simply click to import and you're able to see that all your media is added over here. You can simply drag it onto the timeline and start animating. So I hope you enjoyed these updates. Make sure to download the latest version by simply restarting your app and using the installer configuration or you can download it at download.createstudio.com. And as always, have fun creating.